Hey, hello, how are you? Hope you're having a great day. I am Bert, and you are watching either Angry Buzzard Autos or Road Odyssey. Well, thank you so much for joining me in this video. It's going to be a quick hit and run on the Route 66 Auto Museum located in Santa Rosa, New Mexico. It is between Albuquerque, New Mexico and Amarillo, Texas. It is off Highway 40 and it is on, I guess you might say, Business 40 or more literally on Route 66. When we took our 3,000 plus mile road trip, Santa Rosa between Albuquerque and Amarillo off 40 was our first pit stop. And here you'll see the location is on Business 40, also known as Route 66. Very easy to find. Now, it's not a gigantic museum, but it is big enough that you will spend at least a good average time of 45 minutes or more. It's $5 per person. They have a snack bar and all that kind of stuff. And it's, it is packed full of memorabilia. So you can spend a long time just noodling around through the place looking at just even that. Uh, you can take pictures. It's open every day. It's not crowded at all. So if you want to take a group of people to a cruise out that way, or if there's a bus trip or anything like that, uh, they could probably accommodate you very well. But be courteous. Give them a call if you've got a bunch of people going out there. Now, they always have a good, probably around 30 cars in the facility. And a lot of the cars are actually even up for sale. So the owner of this place has been doing this for uh, 20, 30, 40 years, a very, very long time. So the cars are really nice and you will really enjoy it. They're all unique, great variety. So let's get into what I saw. Like I said, quick hit and run. So here we go. First off, you can look up Route 66 Auto Museum on the internet, hit their website, or you can go out to Facebook and find them. Here's the front of the museum. You'll see the car way up on the pedestal, easy to spot. And here's the front facing of the museum. And out in the parking lot, you'll see these very unique, I believe, Etzels. So, pretty funny. I believe either the owner or some friends or somebody had pulled up out front, got a picture of their old truck. Here's the entrance. You can see me in my red shirt taking a picture in my little red Corvette off to the left. And when you enter, you immediately know that there is going to be a whole lot of stuff in here to look at. A lot of neat old photographs and maps and things like that. Here's a cool old uh, motorcycle. Can't pass this up either. And so then we went ahead and looked around the parlor a little bit. And then we went ahead and went inside, started looking around. From here, I'm going to be quiet and just play some music over the video and photographs. Just let you sit back and enjoy it for a few more minutes.
video. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please subscribe down below. Thank you very much. And of course, this was a hit and run video, but I still hope you got a very good idea of how nice this place was and how accommodating it really is. So try to relax, take it easy, and I will see you the next time around. Bye. About a block away from the Route 66 Auto Museum was this auto carrier. And it looks like it may or may not be for the museum. Uh, it's unique specialty in classic cars is either where these cars came from or going to. Don't know. See it on the uh, this Rambler here. But very neat cars. Thought you might want to look at this real quick as we end this video.